teaching you how to get rich in your 20s and 30s. This is coming from someone who was living paycheck to paycheck, but then became a millionaire at the age of 30. Today, let's talk about the number one mistake that I see people make that keeps them stuck. And when I tell you this, it's going to seem so simple, but if you master it, your entire life will change. Imagine you needed to go and water your favorite plant because you want it to grow. You take your favorite watering can over to the kitchen sink and you start filling it up. The can is full, you walk it over to your plant, but by the time you get there, the can is empty again. And you're like, what the F? Maybe I wasn't paying attention. So you go back to the sink and you fill it up again. Go back to your favorite plant and again, there's no water in the watering can. So you decide to do a little bit of investigating and you see there's water all over the floor. The watering can actually has three huge holes in the bottom of it. And you realize that because of these holes, the water is going out of the can as fast as it's come in. And you haven't actually been able to retain any of that water inside the can to do what you need to do to reach your goal of watering your favorite plant. This is what happens when you say you want to build wealth. Wealth is your flower. You want to water it, let it grow. But you are letting all of your resources, aka your water or your money, fly out of your life. Active income, the money that you work for, that's the top of the income funnel. If you want to start making free money with investing, you need to learn how to take that active income and pull it down into passive income like stocks and real estate. If you always spend all of your money up here, you have no way to bring it down. You won't actually get further ahead. The mistake I see a lot of people make is they're spending all of their money on liabilities instead of assets. Now, this is in response to a comment that I got on this attached video that seems to have disappeared talking shit about how I'm sitting in a Corolla talking about building wealth. No, number one, this is not a Corolla. This is a Kia, my friends. And number two, if I spent all of my money on liabilities, I would no longer have any money. My goal is not to have a bunch of shit and to have to work forever. The real rich know this. The real rich know that time is your most valuable asset. So I use my money to buy assets that buy me back my time. And because I don't spend all of my money today on things that don't actually bring any more value to my life, like a more expensive vehicle, now I have more money to put into my investments, and that's why I get paid out six figures a year without having to work. That's why I can take a vacation whenever I want. That's why my mortgage is paid without me having to get up and do anything. That's why I will never have to tell my kids, sorry, mommy can't make it because I'm working late. That's why I will never have to work for a bad boss again. Because what good is a Rolex if it just tells you when your lunch break is over?